Hello everybody and welcome back to Amazing Tech for All. Today I thought we'd make a short video on how to add plugins onto Jellyfin. So let's get right into it. Let's sign in. And uh, so far I've only added a single folder where movies can be uploaded to. So to get to the plugin uh, section, you can click on the burger button and then on dashboard and here down to the bottom you'll see a list of plugins here's my plugins um, which is sort of standard that comes with jellyfin and then there's the catalog so the catalog <coughs> will be a short list of plugins that's already in the in a repository the standard repository that comes with jellyfin but let's take a look and see if we can find an alternative let's just uh, find one quickly Let's see. Okay. So here we have the Jellyfin plugins. We can go directly to the collection, to the standard repository. But there's also one under GitHub. Now these are, these add a lot more features and functions to it. So let's go to that one. Let's see. Here we go. And so we can scroll down. So one of the interesting ones is the media upload plugin. So we'll click on that. And then we will go to catalog and we will click on the little gear over here next to catalog and we'll press the plus button or the plus button we will copy the url let's see it's a little json over here copy that this one allows you to upload content directly We'll copy that and we'll go to the repository and we'll give it a name. Uh, let's click here and then a remote upload. Click on save and click on OK. So once we've added the plugin you will have to restart a jellyfin so let's click on the restart restart button over here that'll take us uh, it'll take a few seconds and once the restart has happened then we can add the plugins through the catalog so let's just see how far that is hopefully it doesn't take too long okay Let's see, it looks like it. There we go, remote upload. You click on that icon and it'll ask you to do the install. Once we've installed, we'll have to do the restart one more time. So we'll click on restart. Yeah, it's a little bit of a warning. We we'll click on install. <coughs> okay, it looks like the installation has happened. Let's go to dashboard one more time and click a restart one more time. Right. So I'm going to find some content that we can upload through the web interface. This plugin allows you to upload content via the web interface instead of using a share like a Samba share or window share or NFS. Um, it allows you to copy content into a folder that has predefined and it will then do the metadata downloads and so on. Okay, so once we've restarted the Jellyfin service, uh, we can find, you'll find the remote upload button over here. So this requires a little bit of configuration because you'll have to select the folder that you're going to put it in. So if you click on the forward slash, click there and just click on search in my case i think it'll be under movies let's just confirm that see if there's anything like it nope there is no such thing do one more search just scroll down and there we go we've got movies over there so let's see do i do this select it didn't oh there we go let's see there we go. 
choose folder upload folder folder not found that's very strange but okay yes there we go so now this is the folder it's going to be uploading to so i can browse to a area where i can find my my movie so we'll select the file that we want to upload click on open and click on the upload and it will then upload the file to the folder and in the process it will once it's uploaded it will go and find the metadata for this particular movie that's a convenient way of importing movies through the web interface without having to map special drives let's take a look let's go go back to dashboard let's uh, rescan all the libraries Hopefully this doesn't take very long. In the meantime, if you right click on this top end over here uh, and say, oh, click on open new tab, you should then see the content over there. So there we go. We now have a movie in our, in our Jellyfin server. And it is giving us all the details. It collected all the metadata. And you can see the actors, the movies. So this is a, a wonderful way to start your Jellyfin or collection. Let's see. Your movie collection on Jellyfin. This is perfect. Okay, thank you for watching. If you found this useful, please don't hesitate to subscribe. Uh, leave messages, comments, and we'll see. And we'll respond as soon as we can. Thank you very much.